Get ready to have your mind blown as we uncover the secrets of this amazing sugar that could actually be the key to unlocking your body's full potential and kicking disease to the curb. So what exactly is the ribose? It's actually a special kind of sugar that's found in all your cells. It plays a big role in production energy in your body and is also a key part of DNA and RNA which are like the blueprints for your cells. So as a supplement, the ribose is often used to help with heart disease and chronic fatigue syndrome. It is a natural substance that's actually super important for a lot of things that happen in your body, especially something called glycation. See, glycation is when a sugar molecule bonds with a protein or fat molecule. Now, if you have any kind of disease, the ribose is a must-have supplement. Here's why. When you're sick, your mitochondria, which is the powerhouse of your cells, start to break down. For example, people with heart disease or let's say severe fatigue often have mitochondria levels below 20% and dropping. That's not really a good way and it means that you're on a fast track to more health problems. But here's the good news. You can actually reverse this by using the ribose correctly and following a specific exercise routine. This helps activate healthy cells instead of the sick cells. So let's talk about how the ribose can actually help with athletic performance. See, it's been shown to help you recover your energy faster after intense exercise. So if you're an athlete, I recommend taking 5 to 10 grams per day, especially right after training and of course before bed. Now the ribose is also great for heart health. So it does actually increase your ATP energy levels in your heart cells and improve overall heart function. So if you have congestive heart failure when your heart isn't pumping blood as well as it should, see the ribose can actually make a big difference depending on how serious your condition is. So you might need anywhere between 5 to 60 grams per day. Now the ribose has also been shown to lower oxidative stress in your arteries when combined with another supplement called acetyl alcarnitin. So if you have a chronic fatigue syndrome or want to protect your brain health, try taking 5 grams of D-ribose in the morning after your coffee and another 5 grams an hour before bed. Now you might be wondering what about side effects. See the great thing about D-ribose is that it's natural substance found in food so there aren't any known side effects so far. And I personally take anywhere between 15 to 60 grams per day. I've had lots of blood work done to check any organ functions and everything looks amazing. Now that being said, it's always smart to cycle your supplement just like you might practice intermittent fasting. And of course this gives your body a break and help avoid any potential issues from heavy metals that might be in the supplements. And as for me, my mitochondria are a bit out of whack right now because due to my last injury, but I'm going to keep track uh, and my progress and hopefully start reversing the damage with the help of the ribos. I'll definitely keep you guys posted. And if you want to learn more healthy tips, check out my website link listed within my video description. And if you have any questions about the ribos usage, just leave me a comment below and I'll do my best to help out. So now let's circle back to what I mentioned earlier about the ribose and serious diseases. See, if you're dealing with a major health issue, try this training routine. So do a HIIT, which is a high intensity interval training with eight reps per exercise until your muscles are totally fatigued. Now aim for once or twice a week and don't train for no more than about 45 minutes to an hour on those days. And after your workout, have some simple carbs like white rice, sweet potatoes, and maybe a ripe banana. And don't forget to take five grams each of the ribose and creatine, plus another 10 grams of the ribose before bed. Now, this method helps activate satellite cells, which are like the reserve troops for your muscles. So it works especially, well, if you're like following a carnivore diet or low carb or even a ketogenic. Genic. And if you're serious about staying healthy and fit, make sure you check out the updated video series I've linked in the description. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel so you never miss a video. Again guys, thanks so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Oh yes, I forgot to mention as well, D-ribose is a perfect remedy for cardiac arrhythmias.